Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna do a one brand makeup tutorial and a review and this is featuring Fashion 21 Cosmetics. I'm using a new camera. So pag may napansin kayong improvement or maybe kinapangit pa ng quality ng video, please leave a comment below so I would know. I'm testing this out. It's the Canon G7X Mark II and this is my first beauty video where I'm using the new camera. I got a couple of things from Fashion 21 and I'm gonna show you the products as we go along the tutorial. Since summer na, I'm gonna try to do like natural makeup look but I didn't want it to be just the plain makeup look. I also want to be a my artist. So, I made my paw freckles. And I know I've already done a video on that using another brand before. But I want to recreate that look using Fashion 21 Cosmetics. We're going to do it for the Nadine Lustre. I'm going to try my best to achieve that. But I also have a different peg. The Kendall Jenner. I know a lot of people have already tried recreating Nadine Lustre's look. I'm going to show you the photo of Kendall. So guys, please remember this is not a transformation makeup look. I don't think I'm going to be Kendall Jenner after, but I'm definitely going to try to get that dewy, blush, fall freckles makeup look using Fashion 21 Cosmetics. If you can see that it's still on my face, I'm so sorry. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be too much. So we're going to start with the base. And the base I have is the Ultimate Cover BB Cream and Concealer in One. And this has SPF 30 plus plus plus, which I think is perfect for the summer because you know, this is in the shade 1. It's summertime. The heat is gonna be extreme. So to stay fresh this summer, you have to make sure that your makeup is lightweight. Ditch the foundation kung kaya and then stick to BB or CC creams. To apply that, I'm gonna use this sponge and it is called the Water Drop Blender. This is also from Fashion 21 Cosmetics. It was before but when I put water, it became this big. Twist the cap to open the BB tube and I'm putting a little bit. This is the consistency. It's not too watery. I'm using a damp water drop blender and I'm spreading out the BB cream like how I always do and just patting. In terms of coverage, it's light because I can see the veins. So do not expect full coverage because it's BB cream. Naman siya. It did a good job in covering a little bit of my circles, although I can still see through my skin, which makes it perfect for that dewy look. Very natural. Lang siya. To the touch, it's not too much at all. It's siya agad. But the finish is not matte. It's better, definitely better. Like the redness of my nose is better on this side because it's so this is how it ended up. I just put the same amount of product to the right side and to the left side. I kind of like it. I'm gonna put a little bit of concealer, not too much. I'm just gonna twist this cap. This is cute here in the product. And this is the concealer. I'm not gonna put it directly on the circles, but I'm gonna put it below the circles. So instead of here, directly on the mata, I'm just gonna put it here. Konting konti lang, just on the areas where I really need coverage because again, I want to make this look as natural as possible. Just dito konti kasi namumuling ilong pa. So I want to eliminate the redness and dito lang. Sponges are best if you want to get rid of the excess product para hindi geeky yung face mo. Now for the concealer though, I'm gonna use my ring finger because that's where we put the least pressure. So it doesn't hurt our skin. So the reason why I'm starting to get back here is that I don't want it to look like I put concealer. So by the time na umabot ako dito sa eye bags, konti konti na lang yung product, just enough to make it look better. Pat that also on my nose because it's so red. By the way, guys, sobrang init ngayon. Sobra, like I don't know what the temperature is, and maybe I should check every time I switch off the fan. Oh my god, it's 33 degrees. The concealer is very blendable. I love it. I'm actually not a fan of concealers, but I like this one. Pansin nyo hindi ako masyado nagko-concealer sa mga beauty videos ko. Kasi I like having eye bags. Ayan yung pag may concealer na. I like it. It's so dewy. I'm going to show you a couple of powders that are available in Fashion 21 Cosmetics because they have different kinds of powders. The ones I have are the two-way cake powder. 
Fashion 21 Cosmetics 2 Way Cake Powders have different variants. So, Merong Tea Tree Oil, Papaya Extract, My Classic, and the one with Milk Moisturizers. This also has SPF 35++. Siyempre, pag binuksan mo, ganito siya. Meron siyang sponge. And then when you open it, there is a mirror. There's the powder. I got the shade 1. This is also available in different shades. So, there are two ways to use the 2 Way Cake Powder. Kaya nga siya, 2 Way Cake. You can use it as a foundation. If you use a damp sponge, tapos ginunan mo siya. It can work as a foundation. But if you want just light coverage, then go ahead and use your trusty brush. And that's what I'm gonna do. Only on the areas where I need it. Here I'm gonna use the Milk Moisturizers variant. So gusto ko to kasi it's very yellow tone and it's perfect for my skin. And as you can see, I'm only patting it on some areas like on my forehead, on my nose, under the eyes. Para lang hindi mag crease yung BB cream na nilagay ko. Now that our base is done, let's work on our eyebrows. I got three products for the eyebrows. I have eyebrow pencil. One is in chocolate brown. That was the other one is a duo eye enhancer. This is blonde. I also have duo eyebrow powder. It has two colors. It has brown and black. So I'm going to start first with the chocolate eyebrow pencil. I'm not going to use this for my eyebrows. This will be for my freckles mamaya. I think I'm going to use this camera na to. Pwede ko kayo i-zoom in ng todo. Wait lang. Yun. So, kitang, kitang, kita, kita niya yung lagpas ng contacts ko. Ayan. I'm gonna be using this brush. Brush away yung hair para malagay lang sila sa lugar. So, I'm just gonna do my eyes the usual way. It's so weird, no? What if I talk to you this way? Just my eyes. Joke lang. So, nothing new with my brow routine. Susundan ko lang talaga yung shape ng eyebrows ko. And of course, kind of emphasizing the edges. And so I'm just gonna fill in the gaps. And chamber, I'm gonna brush through to make sure that there are no harsh edges. Ito na yung powder na gagamitin ko. And I'm gonna focus first on this black one. Dito. Paganon. Tapos in the middle part, ito na yung gagamitin ko. I think na ito is a little too tiny for me to control. So I'm gonna use another product from Fashion 21 Cosmetics, which I find is so cool. Multifunction brushing tawag sa kanya. Merong one for the lip. And meron ding another one as liner. And another one for the eyebrows. Tatanggalin mo lang yung dulo. Put it in like so. So from here, miglang ganon. So now I have the one for the eyebrows. I'm gonna use this to apply this product. Light strokes lang yung gagawin ko, so you know how it is. Kind of an ombre effect yung kailangan kong achieve for this look. Ayan na yung eyebrows natin. So this is obviously with the eyebrows and without the eyebrows. Alam ko hindi siya pulido, but again, I don't want it to be overly done. So I'm gonna leave it like that. Now that my face and my eyebrows are done, I'm gonna move on to the eyes. And the product I'll be using is Fashion 21's eyeshadow kit. This is eyeshadow kit number five. If you look at the colors, it's more on the bronzy side. The first color I'm gonna go in is the second color from the top. So I'm just spreading that all over my lids. And I'm also using a brush to blend that in. Next color is the lightest color of the palette. That was ko concentrate ko lang siya sa gitna. Upper and lower lids. Tapos sa outer corner naman, I'm gonna use the darkest shade of the palette. For the lashes, I'm gonna use the Double Up Mascara and this is supposed to lengthen my lashes. Meron kasi siyang formula that is designed to make the lashes twice as long as it should be. Here, I'm just coating my upper and lower lashes. After two minutes of application ng mascara, it's a damp pa yung eyelashes, so it kind of takes a couple of minutes before it dries up. I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that, because after ko mag mascara, I curl ako ng lashes. Mayan pinapakaram naman ko medyo hindi pa siya so brown dry, so give it like a full four minutes before you curl your lashes para sure na hindi masisira yung ginawa niyo makeup look. I wasn't able to get a contour shade from Fashion 21 Cosmetics. But I will try to use this shade. I hope it works. There's a little bit of shine, but I think we can work with it. Just make sure to go in the light hand lang. Pwede. Pwede yo. I love it. Actually works. 
Even if I don't put highlighter, okay na yun. Because I left that part without a powder. So ngayon na nakapag-contour na tayo. It's time for my favorite part. And it's the blush. We have the Lip and Cheek Gel. Also, of course, from Fashion 21. What I like about it is that yung cover niya, meron siyang yung parang pantusok sa loob. So that hindi siya nagda-dry and nagsistick. This is in the shade number 2. So let's do a little test dito sa kamay ko. Baka kasi sobrang pigmented. Ayan, ganyan lang ka konti. And it's very pigmented. Also, it dries up fast. You have to use it on your face. You have to make sure that you blend na agad. So we will focus mainly on this area. Para mukha siyang totoo. Tapos pag feeling mo sumobra yung blush, you could always get the help of your water drop blender para ma-pick up niya yung excess na blush. Because over the nose, I always do this even that pa. And I think you would know. Even if you go back to my oldest video, you would know na ganito talaga yung gusto kong blush. Yung parang natural. So think, saan ka ba namumula when you're laughing or when you're just naturally blushing? This is fast drying, by the way. So you have to be careful when you're putting it. You have to make sure na mabilis ka mag-blend or you have a blender ready. So a tip that I got from Rai is to mix it with your foundation para yung consistency niya parang BB cream or foundation. So I'm gonna mix that. Yan. Then mas madali siya i-blend. So I'm also kind of putting the blush in a way na para siyang nagsha-shape ng face ko, nagko-contour kumbaga. And then again over the nose. Yeah, so I think I got that down. I love it. Wala akong kinuhang lipstick. Pagdating naman sa lips, lalagyan lang ako ng konting-konting BB cream. Pasensyahan niyo na ha. Alam niyo naman laging dry yung lips ko. Sorry na, ang kuno kay magalit. <laughs> so konti lang ng BB cream. Just to like neutralize that, I'm gonna use some leftover for my finger. Ganyan lang. I'm gonna use the same one. Very, very little amount lang. Sa gitna lang. Yung pink is really just in the inside. We're not gonna fill in the whole lip. Freckle time. Dito na papasok yung dalawang eyeliners that I was talking about. I have one in chocolate brown and another one in blonde. So one thing I noticed about freckles is that they should not be in the same size. Yung iba mas makapal, may iba mas maliit, yung iba mas light, yung iba mas dark. And I'm gonna start with blonde. Pag yung pencil, medyo hindi pa siya gamit. Try to do that on the back of your hand para you don't feel like you have to hurt your skin to get it to come through. Any size will do. For now, we have these marks. Once I start adding the darker dots, then I think it'll make sense. <laughs> Let's use chocolate brown now. And this is our finished look. I'm really happy that I tried out Fashion 21 Cosmetics. To be honest, it is my first time to try any of their products. Lahat sila gusto ko. I think they're really worth a try. I really recommend that you try the Double Up Mascara. I really think that it does a good job for its price. I mean, look all. Nakot niya yung lashes ko ng ayos and they're really up there. I also like the Fashion 21 Lip and Cheek Gel. Just be careful because it dries up really fast. I mean, look at my hand. I had to try it a couple of times. You know. I also loved the Ultimate Cover BB Cream and Concealer in one. It blended well into my skin. I've always liked the no makeup makeup look as much as possible. I try to keep my makeup minimal, and even my friends know this. Na ayo ko yung masadong plahaling foundation. Gusto ko yung hikita para yung skin ko, and I think it did just that. 
I mean, I can still see my eye bags and some of my wrinkles and, and that's fine. That makes me real. But there is coverage, so I like this one too. Super panala din sa akin yung mga two-way cake powders ng Fashion 21 Cosmetics. And I love the idea that it has variants. And the last one that I highly recommend is the Water Drop Blender. I actually got eyelashes and a lash glue too. I just chose not to use it anymore. The yung lashes na kinuha ko. This is number two ng false lashes nila. I also got their eyelash adhesive. Gusto ko siya kasi it's in a bottle. Maganda yung applicator niya. If you have any other requests or suggestions, please let me know in the comments section. Give me your feedback on how you're using this camera for beauty videos because if not, I'm gonna go back to my Canon 550D. If you want to check out more products from Fashion 21 Cosmetics, they are available online. They're on Instagram, they're on Facebook, and they also have a website where you could already check their prices and the available shades for every product. And that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, and you stay weird. Tell me you're quite, but I see past your bluffing for some